As in a court session, it's always good to see evidence when condoning a person. So Mr. John Overkill, myself, on behalf of just about every single person you have called out on the internet, we would like you, without doxing or encroaching on people's privacy, to provide some form of information or evidence that we can work with, scrutinise or look into ourselves. We will accept a passport, birth certificate, driving licence, national insurance, citizen card, ID card, pay slips, a photo of a person coming out of a police station or caught around police officers or even in the vicinity of MI5 or something around this area to bring evidence saying that Grey Bleeder stood next to Pierce Corbin filmed by Tyrant Finder is proof they are agents. It's getting kind of boring and it's wearing thin now. So when the country opens up on the 29th of March and the Featherlight campaigns that you condemn and don't go to but you start nicking everyone's filming from the people you are calling actors at the same time, that will be your time limit. And if you can't provide the information and evidence from the past actors or any going forward, then it just makes your whole channel look desperate and irrelevant conspiracy theories that hold no weight and have got people into trouble whilst dividing the community more than anyone out there. It even crosses the line of online abuse and bullying, which is a criminal offence. You've even trademarked Grey Bleeder as some form of shame product that you own. I mean, talk about crass or... Or what? When you can't answer any questions, you then move on to pointing out someone's weakness, a hateful made up claim about someone, or you just ignore that question. None of this is uniting the people, regardless of whether you think you are or you think you're not. You're just a <laughs> sat behind his PS4. As for Shield Destroyer, I questioned the way you shout at people while shopping in which you attacked me. So I had to mention that I don't like the fact that you're spreading false information about legalese and law that you don't even understand yourself. Other than that, I don't really care about you. You're so evidence and solutions, not paranoid beliefs and problems. Let's see you prove any one of your claims without reverting or sidetracking this question. And you can ignore this question all you like, but we are calling you out right now. We would like you to provide some evidence, just one bit of evidence to any of your claims. Otherwise, you're just pointless and you're going to fade into history as a.